Well, hello, it's Pastor John from St. John's Lutheran Church, again saying hello to all of you, especially to boys and girls. Every Wednesday, we post up a story time with Pastor John. I love to come on to sing a simple song with you and uh, to read a story. Moms and dads or adults who are with us, um, every Wednesday, you should go to the Facebook page for St. John's Lutheran Church. The handle is Welcome to St. John's, and you should be able to find a simple link. We sing a song together, and I try to read a different story for the young people. I'm Pastor John, pastor of St. John's Lutheran Church. Our website is stjohnslexington.com. Our Facebook handle for the church is Welcome to St. John's, and we always invite you to worship with us on Sunday mornings at 930 at that same Facebook handle. If you're in the Lexington County area, drive up to the church. We offer drive-in worship. You can remain in your cars and have coffee, be with family or friends, and worship with us. But boys and girls, we're going to, um, we're going to read a wonderful book today. This story that we'll read today is The World Needs Who You Were Made to Be. And parents, this is from Joanna Gaines. I can't wait to read this story, boys and girls. But first, why don't we sing a song together? This song is titled Jesus in the Morning. And it goes Jesus in the morning, Jesus in the noontime, Jesus till the sun goes down. But we can sing other words too. Love him in the morning, love him in the noontime, love him when the sun goes down. Or serve him. Serve him in the morning, in the noontime, when the sun goes down. It's a simple song. See if we can sing a little bit together. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus in the morning, Jesus in the noontime, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus till the sun goes down. You want to sing with different words? Let's sing it with love him, okay? Love him. Serve him. Serve him, serve him. Serve him in the morning, serve him in the noontime. Serve him, serve him. Serve him till the sun goes down. Isn't that a fun song to sing? Well, let's read a little story that I think you're really going to like. Let me reach back here and get the storybook and maybe situate myself a little bit so we can read this together. This is really a wonderful story, and I love reading this story. So here we go. The world needs who you were made to be. I love the pictures in this storybook. Ready? Today is the day for the ride of our lives, when a confetti of color will fill up the sky. Plenty of pink, a bounty of blue and orange and green and yellow, too. Can you see all the boys and girls, how different they are and how happy they are? We all play a part, both me and you, as we build our very own hot air balloons. We'll gather supplies and make them our own and prepare to make flight in the great unknown. Look how they're preparing to make balloons. See everyone? It doesn't take us long to see that we all work so very differently. Some of us look at plans. Some of us use our hands, some of us make big baskets. We're all working together. Some of us work alone and some of us work side by side. Some of us are quiet and like to think things through and others prepare to chit chat about all they have to do. See the boys and girls working alone or quietly working 
are talking to each other as they work, are planning carefully before they work. Some of us think through every possibility before we jump in, and some of us know what we like before we even begin. Sometimes we're scientific and rely on our smarts. Sometimes we're creative and lean into the arts. One child is thinking and planning and another child is using beautiful art. We all do things differently, don't we? Some of us are resourceful. We like to work with whatever's on hand and some of us are extravagant an interesting word. It's extravagant. We like to go big whenever we can. Some of us are teachers and share what we know, but all of us are learners. Together is how we grow. It's fun to teach and it's fun to learn as well. So by now, you can probably see how we all work so differently. See, boys and girls, they're so different and so special. They're God's children, all of them. We've done our very best and now it's time to fly. See how beautiful it can be when our differences share the same sky. We may not look or work or think the same, but we all have an important part to play. All of us can be kind, compassionate, and gracious. All of us can be helpful, considerate, and courageous. So remember who you are. This is your life to live. Don't ever hold back. You have so much to give. You're one of a kind. It's so clear to see. The world needs who you were made to be. We all look so happy because they are happy with how God has made them. I love this book. And remember, God has made you so specially. God loves you as you are. And God has given you family and friends to remind you of that. And guess what? I'm Pastor John, and I want to remind you that you are special, that you are God's child. Moms and dads, care for your children. And remember, we come to you every Wednesday. Look on the Facebook page for the church, Welcome to St. John's, and find another story in a song. Take care. It's good to see you, and enjoy your evening.